Good morning to all. I'm Dr. Alice Matan, Assistant Professor, Department of Economics, St. Joseph College of Arts and Science, Autonomous, Padalu. Today we are going to see a topic under Business Economics, Unit 4, Theory of Production. Under this, we are going to see the topic, Economies of Scale. What is meant by economies of scale? So economies of scale means advantages of large scale production. That is called as economies of scale. Economies of scale are the main advantage of increasing the scale of production. When we produce in large quantities, generally the production cost reduces. Reduction in the cost of production when the output is increased is called as economies of scale. Large scale production is economical than small scale production. Now we will see the how it is divided economies of scale. We have internal advantages as well as external advantages. So, for, by producing in the large scale, inside the industry also we have uh, advantages, outside also we have advantages. Under internal economies, we are going to see labor economies, technical economies, managerial economies, marketing economies, financial economies, risk minimizing economies. Under external, we are going to see economies of localization, economies of production, economies of vertical disintegration, and economies of Byproducts. So, internal economies, that is, because of a large scale production inside the industry, how we are able to produce. Labor economies. In a large scale production, division of labor happens because we have a large number of laborers. So, because of the division of labor, there is specialization. So specialization will increase the skill of the labor force. Because of the specialization, time saving is uh, we are able to save time. Then we are also able to invent the new products. Then uh, the efficiency of labor also increases and reduces cost. Technical economies. Economies of superior technique is possible only in a large scale industry. It can use high technology, it can produce high quality goods and cost can also be reduced. Small firms cannot use high technology. Economies of a linked process. Arranging production process in, in a correct sequence can lead to make production continuous. This is possible only in the large-scale industry. Economies of power. Use of large machines are more econ economical than using small machines. Example, 10 small machines produce 10,000 units, whereas one big machinery produces 10,000 units. You are choosing one big machinery is economical than choosing 10 small machines because power consumed by 10 small machines is more than one big machinery. The next advantage of uh, large scale production is managed real economy. As a firm grows, there is a greater potential for managers to specialize in particular tasks. That is, example, marketing. Marketing managers will only see to the buying of raw materials or machines only in the purchase. Or they will see to the sales. Likewise, human resource management will see to the management of the human workers. Then finance. Those who are uh, specialists in finance will see to the financial in the level of the industry. So specialist managers are likely to be more efficient as they possess 
and high level of expertise, experience, and qualification compared to one person in a smaller firm trying to perform all the roles. Marketing economies. So if a firm purchases high volume of raw material from the supplier, it costs less than purchasing small volume. Employing purchasing experts to purchase required raw material for the production prevents wastage of excess raw material and also reduces cost. The next advantage of large scale production is financial economy. Larger businesses have a good track record. So large firms uh, can easily find potential lenders and also raise money at a lower interest rate. Recognized firms can get money easily from money lenders and can also raise money at lower rate of interest. Can easily raise capital by issuing shares. So these are the internal economies of scale. Next we'll see the external economies. What are the advantages of large scale production outside the industry? External economies are those which are shared in by the number of firms or industries and the scale of production in any industry or group of industry increases. Economies of localization. All firms should be localized to have economies. Different production departments should be located at one place. This give advantage in transportation and in timely labor utilization in production. So, if uh, everything is located in one place, very easily you can transport the labor or any other goods from one place to another. Next uh, advantage is the economies of information and technical market intelligence. Industry enjoys research advantage when management can get whatever the information they want. Within short time, when firms are alloc allocated at one place, so this is possible when the firm is allocated in one place. That is economic info, information and technical market intelligence. Next one is the economies of byproducts. Usually the large scale, uh, in large scale production, when you produce one product, uh, we get, there is a wastage, uh, wastage. So that wastage can be used to to produce another product. So in a large scale industry, you can uh, produce many byproducts. The firm using one raw material for manufacturing different other products can give more returns. That is profit to the firm. Example, Amul India company producing different food products from milk. So they are producing milk, cheese, butter, buttermilk, ice cream, so many products they are able to produce. So these are the advantages of large scale production. Thank you.